Hello everyone and welcome to class of Mininet. Today in this class we are going to discuss about Mininet. So Mininet is a network emulator which runs a collection of end host switches, routers and links on a single Linux kernel. So let's discuss about this. So Mininet is basically an approach of using operating system virtualization features and the processes so that it can allow it to scale up to hundreds of nodes. With the help of this, users can implement a new network feature or a new architecture. It, the user can test it on a large topologies with application traffic and then it can deploy the same code and the scripts into a real production network. So why Mininet is designed? This is basically designed so that we can create virtual SDN. We can create virtual SDN consisting of an open flow controller. A flat Ethernet of multiple open flow enabled Ethernet services. We can use multiple hosts connected to those switches. So it has some built-in function that supports different type of controllers and switches. So let's take an example of this diagram. Here we can have switches which are connected to the controller. So this is a controller, open flow controller. We can have various applications on a host connected to the switches. So this is basically emulating hardware network using Mininet. We can design a hardware network using this. So Mininet can simulate SDN networks. It can run controller for the experiments. Mininet by default includes OVCS controller and open V switch. So how do we install it? We can install the controller of our choice using various commands like sudo apt get install pox floodlight this is basically the command meaning that provides a number of commands some of the commands are listed below so in order to run minnet as a root we must use the sudo command so sudo command is a basic command to run minnet so this command starts the minnet topology and enters the command line interface so this sudo mn is like for starting of the topology. Now mnh is basically a default topology like it includes switches which are connected to the host and a controller. mnh is basically a command and it is used in order to see the help menu which is available in a mininet. Nodes, mininet nodes command display the nodes available for the current network which are available for default mininet topology. Dump is basically there. It displays the dump information about all the nodes which are available in a network. H1 ping H2 basically test the connectivity between two host H1 and H2. It will keep on checking the connectivity between host until we stop that command. Mininet H1 ping CL H2 is basically the command which checks the connection between the host for one packet only. And last is sudo mnc command. This is to clear the mininet or previously need commands that are used. So this is basically the introduction of mininet why it is used. Thank you.